Ladies and gentlemen, 16 presentations, only 5 minutes to show the ideas. The first strike of lightning talk session during TNC 17. Next presenter we have is Tiago, another student who's sponsored by FCT and distributed learning based on free and open educational resources, right? Okay. Great. So, hello. Uh, my name is Tiago. I'm from Esmal, from Portugal. And today I'm going to present uh, distributed learning based on free open educational resources. So, uh, I have two questions. Ooh. Uh, do students learn autonomously and do students learn through videos? Uh, so today I'm going to tell you about my story. Uh, I have a programming uh, discipline at my university and uh, my teacher uh, asked me to make a game in JavaScript. So, uh, well, I don't understand uh, how to programming in, in JavaScript. So I had to go to see, uh, to go to YouTube to see some tutorials and uh, I learned to make a game in JavaScript from there. Um, however, on the day of my presentation, uh, my teachers told me that it's impossible that I have made the game for myself. So, uh, why this subject? Uh, the students on the left, that actually is me, I am never appreciated study too much. So, mainly by the traditional method, that is homework and more homework, I started looking for uh, educational alternatives, as well do right. So, uh, in the traditional education, uh, we have uh, students meet uh, the teacher in a physical space and uh, may have on or not some equipment in the classroom. Uh, so, uh, but uh, nowadays, Students have a fantastic ally to support their, uh, their learning, uh, that is the technology. Outside of a classroom, we have internet almost everywhere and uh, mobile devices. We have also Moodle and, uh, and other solutions. Uh, so, uh, the students find and use videos that uh, teach step by step what the students need to learn. Uh, the teacher puts the content on Moodle and the students, so, sorry. The, the teacher puts the content on Moodle and the students learn from YouTube based the content on Moodle. Very good. Hi, I'm, I'm Peter from Giant. I'm here because uh, I work together with Tiago on a new project called uh, Up to University. And Tiago is actually one of our youngest students. So Tiago, tell us about the challenges that you have in first year university. Oh, okay. Uh, most of us problems uh, are related with uh, online tools that, uh, with, that we certainly have to use, uh, like uh, electronic uh, student information systems or lecture recording video and learning management systems, all of that. Okay, so you have to use new technology. And how about the pedagogical aspects? Yes, uh, we have difficulties to adopt the new teaching style in higher education. We have to be much more independent we have uh, to more freedom to choose from knowledge sources, and we uh, can take different learning paths. Exactly. So we identify two major problems. One is with technology, and the other one with the teaching style and the methodology. So in fact, the traditional learning, sorry about the quick slide. So the traditional learning systems are inspired by uh, the Industrial Revolution, right? When the, the kids have to sit in rows and listen to the teacher. This is not productive anymore. Uh, so, Peter, what is your solution? What are you going to do about that? All right, so Slice obviously changes automatically. So we have problems with technology. But actually, the new project will focus on organic education. So we have new personalized learning paths. We focus much more on the, on the teacher support to develop skills. So eventually, we'll create the right conditions for students like Tiago to learn. So basically what we do, we put the teachers and the students in the, in the center of our ecosystem where the formal education systems, things that you can use at school, uh, will sort of interact with all the informal tools, all the examples that Tiago showed us um, in, out in the space, Moodle, the YouTube videos and everything. So we'll focus on this ecosystem and we make sure that we put this in place. So if you want to know more about this, please uh, search for up to you or up to university.eu. We have a website. And uh, we're very glad to help you and talk to you about that. So, up to you. Up to you, Peter. Thanks.